Uh, I was TJ, and uh, I was just gonna decide I was gonna make a video and just show y'all all the snakes I have now. Yeah, I've seen the majority of them, but I have added a few. Yeah, I've seen them all, but I just want to show y'all all at the same time all the snakes I've got now from when I started. And I got one with me right now. It's the lesser. She is, uh, she is pretty. Yeah, she is beautiful. Got gorgeous colors to her, in my opinion. And she's got good size to her. Able to breed. And hopefully I can get some eggs out of her. God forbid, dude. I don't know why she's hooked on the camera. Every one of them hooked on that camera. But yeah, I'm just going to go to each tub and let y'all see each snake. So, here you go. Okay, so we're going to start right here. Let y'all see this one. This is my big female. She is good size. She is a good size girl. And that's my hand. And that's her. Let me focus you in a little bit. That's my hand and that's her. And she is a good one. Hopefully I can get her to breed too. Hopefully. And uh... Y'all just seen this girl, but I'm going to show it to you in some light now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She is beautiful. And uh, this is her to my hand. You know, so she's good. Good size. I believe she can, believe she can breathe now. And uh, let's keep going. There's one snake that I don't believe I have showed in here and it's not because it's not important but I know y'all like to see exciting things and believe me I love them all but I like to show y'all the ones that y'all really want to see but we're going to see them all there he is he's a little he is a little I don't know what you want to call That's him. He's a normal male. He ain't got bad size to him now. He's a... He is a... Little, he's got a good size to him. I gotta fix his bedding because, he, of course, he's moved it around. And this next one's he's in shed. This next one's in shed right here. He will be really bright colored. See, to me, in my opinion, when he's in shed, he looks like a what most inches actually look like after shed. But he's normally very bright. He's very bright inchy, and I, I don't know. I'll show you after he sheds and just show you how bright he really is. He's got some good colors to him. And last but not least, let's get him out of here. Of course he'd be hiding too. That's the chocolate boy. He's pretty too. Pretty, pretty snakes. Let's fix you up. They just ate today. I don't like really handling them after they ate, but you know, sometimes you just gotta fix their bedding so they don't shit everywhere. And you have to constantly rinse the tubs out, but anyway, yeah, that's the that's the snakes right here. And I hope to add another rack to these so I can have a good size. And here's the feed dates. I just started this a few weeks back. But uh Anyway, yeah, that's it. Yeah, so that's my uh, collection so far. And I should be receiving two more here this next week. And I don't know if y'all know him. He's, uh, his name is Nate from H&H &H BP Morse. Um, and if you don't know who he is, check him out because I totally recommend 
him to y'all if y'all want to get y'all snake because he's a good guy and uh, definitely like I know just by talking to the guy whenever these snakes get here they're going to be healthy and everything's going to be fine and you know it's just something I pretty much know before I even get him because he's a he's he's a real good guy he uh he's got it going on but anyway yeah y'all check him out like I said it's Nate from H and H BP Morse and uh yeah I would check him out if I was you and anyway thanks for watching subscribe comment if you got any questions ask and I'll answer them thank you